Okay, so I'm doing a video to upgrade from Windows Home Edition to the Windows Pro Edition. Lots of good features in there. Specifically, I like the sandbox feature. Really good for security. Um, other features in there, which I'll let you just check out their website to see what other options uh, you may like. BitLocker as another example. Um, so if I go on to my system now, I'm going to try out two versions of a product key which you need, other than the one paying for it. Now, I've checked out, as far as I'm aware, this is a, a legal uh, option, nothing wrong with this uh, at all um, that I could see or research from. Um, if you guys find out otherwise, let me know in the comments and I'll be sure to look it up. Um, but I'll just check my system now, which will confirm I'm on the Windows 10 Home Edition. Now one thing that we need to do here is disconnect from the internet altogether. That just um, doesn't cause any interruptions or confusions with the systems. So be sure to disconnect. So if you're on Ethernet, unplug it. If you use Wi-Fi, which probably most people do, uh, then you want to switch that off in the uh, options down in the right task taskbar. So you shouldn't be connected on the internet at all at this stage. So now we're going to go change the product key. We're going to go change product key here. And then I'm going to enter my product key. Now this is my existing license key. So it's on the sticker on the actual PC tower, or you can find it in the registry through PowerShell, which I won't go into, um, but if you guys need help with that or your sticker's worn off, for example, um, let me know in the comments and I'll, I'll stick another video up. Okay, so I've got my license key in here. Now, this sometimes works, um, and I'm not sure quite what the issue is, um, but if it doesn't, I've got another backup key which I can use um, just in case. So I'll try this one first, because in most cases, you'll all have a license key uh, on the PC itself. So we'll try that, and hopefully this works. So click Next. Okay, it's asking to activate, we'll go ahead with that. Just going to pause the video until it goes to the next section. Okay, so it says we've activated this copy of Windows. I'm just going to have a quick look, see what other settings I need to change. Okay, so the existing license key didn't work. Okay, I've left that in the edit. Um, just so you know what it would look like. So if it's saying by activating Windows, it's probably not going to work. So let me just check it again. Okay, so the second option um, didn't work either. So I've tried my existing license key, didn't work. I've tried a license key from a, uh, an old PC, which I no longer use. That also didn't work. So now I'm going to try a third option. I know at the video I said two, um, but there's actually three options. So I'm going to try the third option now. So bear with me. I'll leave a, a copy of uh, this key in the link below um, if it works, of course. So let's have a look.
Okay, so let's try this. Um, I'm not going to say how many options I've got because there may be more, so we'll just give it a go. Okay, so this has recognised it at least as a pro key, so we'll just give that a go and continue. This yet doesn't mean it's going to work, but we'll, we'll let it do its thing. Not sure how long it's going to be, so I'll pause the video until it progresses a bit. Just a quick update, we're up to 70% now. Um, it's just going to keep on going, so nothing has been missed. Uh, so I'll replay it when I get a bit closer to the end. Okay, we're at 100% complete. It's just finalising it now, uh, so we'll see what happens next. Okay, so it's... Um, Configuring the update, so it's all looking good so far. So perhaps it is third time lucky, um, but we'll we'll have a look. Um, you'll be glad to know I've got a fourth option ready, just in case while it was loading. Okay, let me get it back up. Okay, so it is looking promising. It's adding features which it should do, so it's all looking good. So I'm going to try and log in now. Okay, so we are now logged in. So it, it only took a few minutes, so nothing lengthy. So we'll just go and check what version we are. And with a bit of luck, it should say Windows Home Pro. Here we go. Perfect. Okay. So it looks like we are all set. Okay. Now if you want to turn any features on, you just go and start typing in features. There we go. I need to spell it fully. And then it's going to load optional features. So now we can see what we want to add. Now I mentioned earlier that I was really keen on the Windows Sandbox. So you would just click here. Press OK, and then it's going to search for the required files. Now bearing in mind we've done this offline, it would appear that these files are actually already in the Windows Home Edition. Uh, it just needs to, in a lack of a better word, Un be unlocked through the product key because none of this has been done online. Okay, so now we're going to restart. Um, I'll finish the video here, but basically we got there in the end, third time lucky. I'll leave the product key for this one in the comments below and uh, yeah, good luck with your install.